Hello and welcome everyone to this SQL Server tutorial. In this tutorial, you will learn how to create a database in SQL Server Management Studio. So let's get started. First, open the SQL Server Management Studio. After opening SQL Server Management Studio, it asks for connecting to a SQL Server instance. So here, verify the server type, server name, and your authentication method, and click on Connect button to connect to SQL Server instance. And on the left side, you see here the Object Explorer panel. To create a database, you see here the node databases. So simply click on this node and then right click on it. After right click on it, you see here option new database. Click on this. After that, new database wizard or window appear. From here left side, you see here select a page, click on general. And you will see here to enter the database name. So here, enter the database name that you want to create. So in this case, I want to create order database, orders database, and this database is going to contain all the orders. But remember, while you're specifying the name of the database, you need to remember a naming convention. And as you know, you can give a singular or plural names for the database. The name of database depends upon the preference and the specific use case. But the question is when to use singular or plural names for the databases. So for example, suppose if your database represents a single entity, then use the singular name for your database. Let's take an example. Suppose you want to create a database customer and this customer database, which is going to contain all the customer data and it represents the single entity. You can also create a database with plural names. For example, you want to create a database orders database. So in this case, orders database is going to contain multiple orders. So you have given your name orders database. Now to create this database, after specifying the name, simply click on OK button. And now you have successfully created the orders database. To view the database, you see here the databases node, simply expand this and then you see here your database orders database. You can also use a different owner for your database. Let's again right click on this databases node and then click on new database. And here specify the name of the new database which is a customer in this case. And then you can specify the owner. So to specify any specific owner, click on this three dot button. And then here enter the object name, give the name of the owner. So in my case, there is an owner James. So I will write here James and simply click on check names. So it will check the name and then click on OK button. Now here you can see that the, when you create this database, the owner of this database will be James. You can also go to the option and within option, you can change the collation. Here you can see any collation according to your need. Now to create this database, simply click on OK. Now again, you can see here within the database is noted, the customer database. Also, I want to mention here that when you are going to create a new database, always make sure that the new database name does not already exist. Let me show you. So. Again, right click on in databases node and then new database. And this time we're going to create a database customer. And then again, choose the owner, James. And after choosing the name, you click on the OK button. And as you can see, you get the error. The database customer already exists. Choose a different database name. So this means the customer database already exists in your databases you can see here. So before creating a database, make sure that the same name of the database should not already exist in your databases. So close this error. Now I hope that you have understood how to create a database in SQL Server Management Studio. So at last I want to say don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and thank you.